Okay, so we're doing a test video. This is Vesper HBT and Rich Pete. Uh, we do uh, a lot of testing together and a lot of work together. Um, what we're testing right now is a new coil configuration that we're working on. Uh, basically, it's a new prototype coil. And what you're going to see is, is two amp meters here. One is set up for voltage in AC. One is set up for amperage in AC. We have our load source, which is our bulb, which is a 55-watt bulb. Our drive source really doesn't matter. Uh, we're just spinning a rotor with it, which is our motor here. Uh, this is just spinning a rotor so we can test the output of our charge coil. Uh, it runs up into a pulley system. All the wires and meters and other things right here for other tests and things, they're not relevant for this cycle. Uh, the batteries you see in the back are not connected or used. The only thing that we do is run our wires, as you can see, to our meters. And so you have one set up for amperage, one set up for voltage. I'll show you the rotor configuration. The rotor configuration is just some neodymium magnets mounted into the rotor. And uh, Rich Pete here is holding onto the coil. So as you can see, yes, it is a coil. And it's running directly to our connection points up to our light and over to the meter. Now our meter is wired separately. Uh, we have our voltage, which is running across both the uh, start and end of our coil, and our amperage meter is ran in between our circuits so we can measure the amps directly. So we're just going to kick this off and uh, kind of show you. It's going to get a little noisy when the motor kicks on, and uh, we'll show you kind of the results. Later on, I'll do another video that shows the actual light output from the uh, light being energized from a normal source versus what we're actually doing. So you can compare the actual light output because sometimes in cameras it shows something that's not actually true. So we'll show that eventually as well. We're going to kick it off though. All right, so you can see that one coil is producing uh, one of our wires came off. That's why we're not going full. I'm going to go ahead and connect that wire back up. So I'll show you right here. It has just came loose from here. So I'm just going to hold it while we're doing this so we can get our voltage and amperature. So I'll zoom in here. You can see it's 8.9, almost 9 volts. And we're generating 3 amps. Three and a half amps off of one coil. And as you can see, uh, the bulb is illuminated quite aggressively. And I'm just going to show right around the corner here. And you can see that all we're doing is holding the coil up against the rotor. So that's all we're doing here. Comes over, runs down. Our motor source is uh, energizing here. Coming back up to show you the actual amperage and voltage once again. Again, they're set at AC voltage and AC amperage. So from one coil, that's a pretty astounding result. Uh, we'll show you another video that uh, will show the actual light output of our actual bulb. And uh, we'll show you what's going on with that in another video. Thanks for watching.